From the sound of this welding machine, this young man hears sounds of music. On Lifestyle Today, we profile Andrew Kafupi, a Zambian upcoming musician whose stage name is Tasca. The 33-year-old had his first single hit the radio waves in 2008 with his popular song Najaila Kanga featuring Gizi. He shares with us about his journey in music. I did uh, my first single when I was still in school uh, with Josie Beats. That one was called Cinema Gona Tulo Pali We Baby Wanga. It was a big song by then. Then I did the other one, which was Najaira Kanga Ndieka Meneka Manvesa Mushe. That was one of the biggest songs in the country way back in 2008, 2009, somewhere there. Andrew Kafupi shares with us about his education background. My primary background, I was at Kandawire High School from grade 1 to grade 7. Yeah, and then grade 8, 9, and 12, grade 8 to 12, I was at uh, Arakan High School. With this kind of music, one may wonder where he gets his inspiration from. I love listening to uh, East African music, you know, talking about artists like Asley, you know, Diamond Platinums, and uh, Ali Kiba, you know, yeah, I love bongo flavor. Uh, actually, I call my music as in uh, reality vibes, you know, and my name itself, you know, Tasca, you know, those are initials that stands for something. It's an inspirational name. They stand for take advantage, some know already. So my name inspires me. And then my music itself, it's a kind of music that somebody can relate to. If you listen to it, you can get some sense and get to learn, yeah. Apart from music, Andrew is fully involved in a family business of welding which keeps him busy when he is not in the studio. Actually, uh, what I do at the workshop, my dad gave me the position as an, uh, I'm a workshop manager. Take note of every kind of job that comes in the workshop. Yeah, so I need to list down the materials that I needed, you know, the down payments and everything. Yeah, so that's what I really do when I'm not in the studio. I make sure I help out my dad. I help my dad and my family and everybody because I'm the only guy, like, everybody's looking up to because the rest are just girls and my young brother yeah so dad always tells me that all these nieces nephews they look up to you so you need to work hard don't just depend on music you know music itself needs money so this is where you can get your money and invest in the music yeah so we deal in kupenta mamoto kavijana moto kamaningi it was involved in an accident we make sure we put it back in the right shape then yeah, I get back on the road and yeah. So I think you know, this is a job Bunanko school, that's why dad used to get the money from and yeah, pay for my schools and everything. So I really love the job. And uh, apart from panel beating as well, I'm also a businessman, you know. I sell phones at Katondo Street, I sell laptops, so if you go around by Katondo Street they can tell you about me actually. That's why I also survive from. Yeah, because because I'm a parent, actually, I have a child, and I'm expecting twins as well, so I really need to work hard so that I can feed my family. The music industry in Zambia seems to be improving in both video and sound quality. This has made a lot of upcoming musicians to be confident in taking up music as a career. But for Tasca, he feels that one should not only depend on music alone, but to be innovative and get involved in entrepreneurship. As a family man, he feels he needs to work hard in order to provide for his family. Actually, what I'm trying to, to, to do or what I want to do when I become very big in the music industry, I want to invest in the same business like panel beating, I open up a big company, you know, I bring up some more people so that a lot of people can start working. Uh, most of the people out there, well, I would say most of the upcoming out there, I'm going to say, in any music, in any music, in music, but music itself is not fine, it's not alone, because music is a business, it needs finance, it needs money. So what I can say um, to all those that are coming up, at least they need to engage themselves in any kind of, any kind of work. 99 jobs, not kusanka. So long you can get money and you can push your talent because the talent has to be pushed for people out there to see you. That's when they can come in and invest in your talent. So it all starts from you. So my business, because me, 
you know, I've been a taxi driver before, just around here, you know, I, I sell phones at Katondo Street, and most of the people that know me when they come there, they say, ah, musician, yeah, artist, I pay skapa Katondo and everything, you know, but I know what I really want as a, as a human being, as a person, so I don't mind whatever people say, because I know what I want. And the next time, there'll be the same person who'll be saying, ah, enzo peskapano, man, enzo peskapano, you see, so they need to work they need to keep themselves busy. All of slash and you could slash as long as you can do something. And to see a quiver at Tibariambo, a Siva Jan Domino, Funa Kuzika, Pamamba, Monga Branji, then in a Kutista in Kariji base. They are to say, Look, my brother, son, my cousin, in a dinner Munda, what in Matam Kappa TV, but nine in Funa Cheku, Kuima Maning in Chito, with sevens. So I'm going to business. Sometimes we'll see what the to connect to and to see an answer. And I'm going to talk about the brunch panel. Now, when you are busy, you must have a chance to search me. I'm going to have a very good time. Just like any other industry, the music industry is not spared with some challenges. Tasker shares on some challenges he faces in the industry. It's really hard for you to find a manager when you haven't blown up you know it's really hard because most of the managers they want to come in when they've seen that you are trained in when you are making it that's when they want to come so i don't see any point of that manager to come in when you are big and when they don't want to come in when you're not big so what comes in my mind is like maybe they just want to eat your money you know and just try to to steal what you have when you're just depending on music when you're not working when you're not doing something else apart from music it's really hard because music itself, it's a business. You need to invest money in, in, in that. Because the music video is expensive, and audio is also expensive. So you just need to do something else. His latest music video is Wagwesa Glass. Tasca hopes to grow big in the music industry and to be recognized worldwide. Margaret Chisulo in Lusaka.